Welcome to the Living and Flow channel. I'm Taylor Ray, and that's little Sadie. And today is a really short, simple practice to do that's perfect after you're finished working out. So let's go ahead and start. So many places left to go. So many ways that I could roam But right here, right now is all I know We just feeding my soul When live on and flow away All right, so we're going to start in a standing position Feet hips width distance Arms down by the sides Palms face forward, shoulders soft Eyes can close Just starting right here Let's take a deep breath through the nose And an exhale out Open the eyes, inhale, sweep the arms. Right hand grabs the left wrist, and then exhale, we'll start to pull all the way over to the right side. Inhale through center, switch left hand to the right wrist. Exhale, lean over to the left side. Inhale, right back to center, and then exhale, hands behind the back here, make a bind. Next inhale, pull the fist down as you lift the heart. Keep the bind, bend the knees, exhale, fold right down. One time, lift halfway up, inhale, long spine. And then exhale, fold right back down. Release the hands down. Half lift here. And we're going to find a lunge. So the right foot stays forward as the left foot steps back. We'll drop the back knee down here. Top of the back foot is down. Inhale, sweep the arms high. Exhale, just soften the hands to the front thigh. Allow the hips to sink forward. We'll take a few little pulses just to ease that back hip flexor open. So inhale, find some lift as you raise up. And then exhale, sink a little deeper. So just some nice pulses. Let's go one more time. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale, reach the arms. Taking a little twist, left hand to the right knee. Keep pulling the knee in towards the center. As the right arm extends back, gaze towards that back hand. So now we're leaning our chest back right here. Let's take one more breath. Inhale, arms sweep. Right here, hands come down. Back knee lifts. We're gonna to start to crawl all the way over. The right foot turns in, now we're in a wide leg stance. So we'll take a little side to side, side lunge. So let's turn the right toes out to the right side a bit as we crawl our hands over and bending into the right knee. So fingertips can stay down right here. You can use your right elbow to press the right knee back. Inhale, pull through center and we'll switch. Left toes turn out, left knee bends, and the left elbow presses the knee back a little bit. Let's go one more time to each side. Inhale through center, exhale, bend into the right. Inhale, exhale, left. And then from here, you're going to slowly turn to shift now to the back of your mat. So now we're in that runner's lunge and we'll drop the back knee down. Top of the back foot down. Inhale, arms reach. Exhale, hands to the front thigh, shoulders soft on the back. So three little pulses. Inhale, start to shift up. And then exhale, settle the hips down. Two more times. Inhale up. And exhale. Good. One more time. Inhale, rise. Exhale, lower. From here, right hand to the left knee. Left arm extends back for a gentle twist as you keep pulling the knee in to lean back a little bit more. Take a deep breath in. And inhale, sweep the arms. Exhale, hands down. Back toes tuck, back knee lifts. One more time. Crawl it to the center, left toes turn in. Once again, we're in a wide leg stance. Inhale, lift halfway. 
exhale, crawl both hands and wrap the hands around the left ankle. Forehead pulls towards the left knee right here. Two breaths. One more. And release through center, inhale. Switching sides, hands crawl around that right ankle as you pull yourself in, forehead towards that shin. Take one more breath. And release. Hands come down. Inhale, lift halfway. Exhale, we'll stay here for a few breaths in a wide leg fold. So fingertips can stay down. Maybe you have space, hands start to crawl back through the legs. Crown of the head reaches down. Hips lift and the weight shifts forward just a little bit here. Nice and easy, inhale, lift halfway. Let's crawl back around to the front and then we'll step back into a downward facing dog. So we'll take one downward facing dog for five breaths. Start to pedal the feet out. Sway the head. And guide both heels down. Pause here for two breaths. Getting into the hamstrings a bit. Feet are hips width distance. Navel lifts. Ribs guide in towards each other so we're not dumping into our chest, our back. And nice and slow, shifting forward as the knees drop down. We'll sit all the way back here onto the heels, sitting up tall. So we'll get into the shoulders just a little bit more. Hands find a bind behind. Inhale, pull the fist down, lift the heart. Exhale, chin tucks. Crown of the head comes down as you pull your fists up. One more time, inhale, rise all the way, heart lifts. Exhale, round, take it down. Inhale, rise, release the hands, sweep the arms. And then exhale, crawl the hand, the right hand to the right side as the left arm sweeps over to the right side. So we'll get to the side body a little bit here and we're gonna stay. So the top hand, the pinky spirals down. Keep grounding that left hip more towards the left side. And we're gonna stay last little bit, top hand behind the head. So the elbow's bent. Now we're gonna just lean the head back and more to the right side, a little bit more. Take a deep breath. And release. Rise through center, inhale, sweep both arms. Switching sides, left hand crawls left, hips keep pressing slightly towards the right as the right arm extends now, pinky down, keep drawing both shoulders away from the ear. Now that last little bit, top hand behind the head, lean the head back slightly and then a little bit more to the left side, take one more deep breath. And release. So nice and slow from here, we're going to swing the legs through to a seat. We'll go out with wide legs. So nice and wide, toes towards the face, hands behind as you scoot the hips forward just a little. Sit up nice and tall here, find some length, shoulders draw down. Take a deep breath in first, and then exhale, easily start to crawl the hands down the center. Inhale, tiny lift. Exhale, fold. One more time. Inhale, find length. Exhale, fold. And we're going to pause right here. Allow the head to relax heavy. Chin tucks in. Last couple breaths. Nice and slow, start to rise. So we're gonna connect the right foot to the inner left thigh. Left leg stays straight. Bring the hands behind first and then just turn the entire chest towards the straight left leg. Sweep the arms high, take an inhale. 
exhale, start to reach over that straight leg. So tight hamstrings, just micro bend, take a tiny bend in that left leg. So hands can go to ankles, to the foot. Inhale, lift. Exhale, fold. One more time, inhale. And exhale. Pause right here. Stay for two breaths. You should feel some nice stretching through that right side of the back. Slowly start to roll up and then we'll switch. So the right leg out, left foot to the inner thigh, hands behind to turn the chest more to the straight leg. Tiny bend if you need, inhale, sweep the arms. Exhale, really lengthen forward as you fold down. So two times with a slight twist on the inhale, lift, and then exhale, fold. One more time, inhale, and exhale, pause at the bottom. Last breath here. And slowly start to rise. So we're gonna take one last pose, soles of the feet together, knees nice and wide, hands interlace underneath the feet. Sit up tall, shoulders draw down the back. As you sit up nice and tall, take an inhale breath. And then exhale, start to melt the chest down. Half lift one time, inhale. Exhale, relax all the way down here. Soften the, the head, soften the shoulders, the jaw. Let's take one last cleansing breath together. Inhale, nice and slow. Big sigh out. And st slowly start to rise. So there you go. Thank you for practicing with me. And to find some more yoga videos, you can subscribe to our Living in Flow channel. Thanks.